I'm Austin from Mountain Boy Journals. Today, I am showing you how to make an egg for like chickens so they would lay. Um, so this is the piece of wood I'm using. Okay, you might need to step back just a touch. There we go. That's good. Okay. So it was just a very short piece of wood that I used from it. Okay. So you can make a lot out of that. And these are the tools I've been using. Okay. You wanna um both from Bucknell. Nice. Okay. Good deal. Very good company. Okay. To buy your nerves and the salt. Okay. And um, what process did you use to get the egg in the form that it is right now? Um, just whittled at it. Like, I'm better at showing than explaining. That's okay. Go ahead. That's why we're videoing. You do. Can you yep. see? Yep. You do the, okay. that to get the first part of your, the bigger end starts first and the Lower end. Okay. Then you work down to narrow it down to the lower end. Yeah. To and make it look like this. Awesome. You did a nice job. It's real cool. Can you, and, and it'll save us a lot of money, won't it? Yeah. Explain, explain why we need those eggs. What happens in the nesting boxes. And you did mention that it helps them, inspires them sort of, and encourages them to lay if they see that in the nesting box. But what else is the benefit? It prevents them from pecking at the real eggs because they think it's too hard right. to peck at with their beak. Right, so they finally give up once they keep pecking at that wooden one. They eventually give up and kind of leave their own alone, right? Mm -hmm. Nice, yeah. The reason we mentioned the price, or I mentioned the price, is we were looking for wooden craft eggs, and around here we couldn't find them, and when we did find uh, a feed store that had eggs, they were plastic like your Easter eggs, which wouldn't hold up, and they were like almost $2 a piece, so, and we ended up using, what do we? What have we been using? Um, golf balls. Yeah. Our Eileen thought we were actually had chickens that laid golf balls. How about it? <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. But, so, you know, there's so much you can do for yourself on the homestead, right, Austin? Yeah. It didn't take you real long to do that egg, right? Maybe an hour. Yeah, not quite, but it's Half good. an hour or something. It's something you enjoy doing too, right? Yeah. Yeah. So do you have anything else you'd like to share with your audience today? I can think of. All right. Well, then. See you later, and God bless.